Assembly line is designed to take a minimum of 90 minutes to complete for students of all ages, using low-cost materials. This lesson demonstrates the power of mass production. Students learn the assembly line process while meeting specific quality control criteria. Prepare for the lesson by reading the lesson plan, reviewing the PowerPoint, and gathering the required materials. To begin, hand out the worksheet and materials and explain the challenge. You're a team of engineers working to help a local toy company implement time savings methods to manufacture color bricks. Each member of your team will design and construct their own brick as quickly as possible. Then the team will work together to design an assembly line to manufacture bricks as quickly and efficiently as possible. Teams may only use the materials provided. The criteria for quality control are as follows. A brick must be made from two brown bags. One bag must be filled with four pieces of lightly crunched up recycled paper. The other bag will cover this bag. The largest sides of the brick must be filled with polka dots, three large one inch diameter and three medium half inch circles scattered per side. One side must have three blue and three green circles. The other side must have three red and three orange circles. The top and bottom of the brick must have four vertical half-inch purple stripes with a half-inch in between each stripe. Both sides of the brick must have color bricks written in black marker. Letters must be centered on the sides and one inch in height and five inches long. The challenge is broken up into two parts. During part one, each team member will create their individual design and you'll document the time it takes. During part two, teams of 10 to 12 brainstorm solutions, draw a diagram of their planned assembly line design on paper, construct their assembly line, and test the line within the team. Encourage students to work together to troubleshoot issues they run into. Remind students that there are multiple solutions to the challenge and that engineers learn from failure and then apply what they learn through multiple iterations of their designs. All teams then present their assembly lines to demonstrate how their design works to assemble as many color bricks as possible in 10 minutes while meeting the quality control criteria. Encourage students to compare the differences between assembling a product individually versus with an assembly line. Finally, celebrate the fact that these students designed a solution using their creativity while learning how engineers impact the world.